guys so we are finally back with some blue lock episode 14 like i said this was my first sports anime so for this to really become one of my let's say top five anime do i want to put it in top five just yet let's say top five for now for this to be one of my top five they did an amazing job i think the animation is one of the biggest things that stands out to me I didn't think this was going to be this interesting just because I really was expecting this to be just a straight up like normal sports show and it's <laughs> not anywhere close to just a normal sports show. We're getting straight into it. These the last few episodes have been nuts. So my expectations are pretty high. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I don't think anyone in this entire building could do anything against them, though, so you're good. Alright, I mean, I was about to say pick him up, but I, I didn't mean literally. I meant just pick up his attitude, I guess. Damn! Sometimes this is exactly what you need, though. Damn. Okay. Nagi reminds me a lot of uh, Levi in the way he tells people how things are. Like, he does not sugarcoat anything. <laughs> I don't know. Nagi gotta be my favorite character, man. I don't think anyone's gonna take his place. They're gonna choose him as their next opponent, aren't they? I, I just don't know if that's a great idea. Of course. Huh? Are, are you sure? <sighs> <sighs> Alright, let's just take the yeah, I didn't realize that until now. Like, why did they... Like, the training went up, but their living conditions got a huge downgrade. I guess they, they probably don't need the incentive of, like, getting better living conditions to be motivated anymore. I didn't even think about that. There ain't no way that man just fell asleep like that. Uh, bro, I, I don't know. For me, I can This is off topic, but I cannot sleep on my back. I don't know if it's just me. Bro, I will wake up not being able to breathe at all if I sleep on my back. I don't know why. I mean, he's done it before where he's basically just done everything on the field by himself when he just like has his moments where he just passes out and his body just takes over. Sometimes this dude is so creepy. This is the way he's like way too innocent. What? Uh? See, when you think about it that way, I mean... Yeah... I would probably pick Nagi, yeah. Okay, I just finished saying that you were innocent. Can you... 
分かってんだろお前も本当に強いやつを仲間にしなきゃこの先無理だってことつうかマジでセラーって夢叶えたいならここは引けないたら終わりだ潰し合おうぜお互いの夢かけてさ Never mind he's not innocent しまりだね Is it weird that every time I see that man's face, he kind of looks like a meerkat? I don't know why that popped up. Yeah, but I just finished saying that this man was innocent. Never mind. He's nuts. <laughs> he's gonna have to have another awakening mid game or something, otherwise, he's getting absolutely destroyed. それまでの人ことだ。でもいいぞチビ。俺は寝る。明日の試合、俺の邪魔すんなよ。ちょろちょろ動いとけ。下手くそ。いいよ。I feel like that's gonna be the only reason that Isagi's team is gonna win is because of Baro being so selfish. So I think it's pretty clear that in raw skill, Baro is、uh, leagues ahead. よろしくキング。I mean, if this match only lasts half of an episode, they gotta win, right? What is that in this pocket? I know they just showed it, but I wasn't sure what it was. Yeah, that's what I thought. I mean, if someone is just sitting there casually talking shit to me, I might just give up. Okay, um. Yeah, you're gonna need、uh, multiple awakenings, I'm not gonna lie. That is such a terrible plan, though. He's literally just hoping that it just comes to him. ナルハヤもかわせないのかナルハヤのパスコースをケアしてるしハンパなパスじゃバローにまた奪われるやべえどうするなぜイサギ何でもいい俺に This man did not just already figure that out. I guess that's why this episode is called The Genius System that Average Shows. Okay. It's just the thing, but you realize the amount of agility that takes to be moving their body like that? <laughs> you might have to just get carried by Nagi this episode, I'm not gonna lie. You only have half of it. Oh, half? Not even half of an episode to get a power up, basically. Yeah. Like I said, this is going to end up being their downfall because he's so selfish. ゴールに背を向けてるナギに対しては前を向かせないように接近するのがセオリーそれを利用予測不能のワンタッチでかわせそれがナギの1対1の攻略でもそれはもう警戒されただから次はナルハヤのようなしないディフェンスになるそうなればディフェンスのプレッシャーがなくなったナギは自由自在好きな空間でプレーできるから出すパスはそのシュート性の強烈なパスでいいここで発揮するのは He is just like, bro. Oh, 
命を吹き込むそ殺して無にする吸収のトラップその二つの対分けることで You're just gonna have to get carried Yeah I hate to say it but that's like that, You're just gonna have to get carried this episode I'm not gonna lie 俺も見つけたい勝ち方をはしゃぐなゲーミングお前らなんぜ俺一人で倒すやばいまたリン Okay <laughs> If he scored there that's Tomorrow would be all time low なるはやリカバリー早いわかってるよキング Oh man バローとナギの得点だったらこの試合の鍵は俺とナルハヤが握ってるおいイサギなんで俺がおまと思ったかわかるかあ,あそりゃナギは<笑>まあそれが前提だけどまあお前になら勝てると思ったかどうどうどうどうどうどうどうどうどうどうどうどうどうどう何ができないのか潔一人で戦える選手じゃない<笑>こいつイガミアパチラみたいに一人でゴールを決められるわけでも周りからの課題評価で生かされてきただけの<笑>ナギアバローみたいな天才じゃない俺もお前盆栽側の人間だ何やってる潔<笑>やべえおそまつ I mean, if he truly believes they're both just like average, you shouldn't be here. <laughs> like, the whole point of this is to have an ego. I was about to say, no way he passes back to that. See, yeah, see, this is why I'm glad I didn't react to this as it was coming out because that would have pissed me off so much if I wasn't able to just go to the next episode. Oh my god, that would piss me off if I had to wait a week for that. Oh man. Yeah, we're going straight into the next one. That is so backwards to me. It's like, what is the point in you trying to win if you don't believe that you're anywhere close to the best? Like, you might as well just leave. You're losing the mental game. Come on, bro. You're letting this weasel talk you down like that? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Okay. I mean, I that's what I'm saying. I hate for you that you're not really doing anything to help other than like passing semi good passes. I think the best thing is just just let Nagi get carry. <laughs> Why did he just scream like that? Okay, I don't. That is an insane save where he was initially. <laughs> I mean, he literally just stopped him in his tracks by just looking at him. Oh god. Bro, please have some type of awakening so my boy Nagi is not doing this 1v2. Yeah, I mean, I feel like this isn't something that you should just now be figuring out, but. Oh, 
Demon was really going crazy with the trash talk in the middle of that match. These little animations to like push the narrative is actually amazing. It's just small things like that that just stand out so much. Oh, I'm giving a minute. He, nah, he, see, he, he's onto something. He's got the little thinking. Yeah, you see someone doing this mid soccer match. You're about to see some something crazy. Is he using water breathing technique? Said that to get to the good part. Basically, that man is really like living the future in his head. Okay, I didn't think we would be getting a little background for him. That, that was a little creepy. Oh, damn. I see. I was about to say. Damn. Damn. See? See, when they do stuff like that, because they did this with multiple characters now, where I, like, initially, like, d didn't like them, one of I just straight up hated, and then they show a background, and then you just feel bad, and you want them to win. But at the same time, you don't want them to win. It's like watching American Idol or X Factor or something like that. As soon as someone gets on the stage, they start telling, uh, well, my dad is currently in the hospital with cancer, and then it's like, bro, it's every time it's like, damn, well... Now I have to root for them to win because I want them to get the money for their parent that's dying from cancer. It's like, well, now I can't hate him. I feel like that's a cop out in this story, though. You like, you gotta make me feel a different way from something else. Now I can't root against him. Now I just feel bad. Damn, that's what that is. Okay. Now I'm just gonna feel bad if this man doesn't win, but I also don't want him to win. They do an amazing job making you really feel conflicted during these matches. It's 4-4. Oh. So, and this is, this is why they're gonna lose. What kind of spin was that? Oh my god, that was way too close. <laughs> I'm sorry, I feel bad, but that yeah, that's a mentally destroyed him. <laughs> Damn, 
周りを確認する弾を動かさないと見ることができない今バロは目の前に追走してくるボールを持つナギの動きこの2点を警戒でも同時に見ることは不可能だからこそ生じる一心をつけ追いつこうとするバローの中心さらに逆ここだナギ俺にだめるよストライカーお前バロー俺のステップワークとりあえずだけじゃ行くんだその先へまだ見るしおまえだな Oh, I, I need to see that. I'm sorry. I usually don't go back in these, but. This right here? His shots always look so crazy. Yeah. That's it. That was way too close. This show just continuously tries to give me a heart attack. Oh. I, I really do feel bad, man. But it's like at the same time, you went around it all the wrong way, bro. I feel like I can't even like celebrate for him. It's, I don't feel like it's a fun win. I mean, it probably wasn't the best idea to try something for the first time in that situation. Yeah, I think we already knew that. Please pick him. I, I feel so bad, bro. Bro's gotta go. I'm sorry, but he like he's not good as a teammate for anyone. Oh,、no. I get it, but oh, <laughs> I'm gonna need to see this man get some type of like money or something. Go pro. At some point in this show, otherwise, I'm just going to feel like shit the entire time. Oh, stop, bro. I... Oh, man. I, I can't even be happy about their win. They're gonna have to break down Borrow a little bit, though. 100%. <laughs> you didn't have to say that. When they play against each other, those two teams are going to be crazy. I mean, they got some crazy strengths on both ends of that team. Yeah, that's. Oh man, that's gonna be a nice fight. But uh, one hundred percent. What what is there twenty? Is there twenty four episodes that's going to be total? So yeah, we're finally catching up. We just got episode sixteen, and then we are caught up. It'll be weekly again, and we'll be focusing on mainly Attack on Titan. But with this show, yeah, a after this one, I th it's very safe to say top five shows of all time for me. But that's also like I'm. I love sports, so I kind of knew that 
this being my first sports anime, it was going to stand out regardless, and it stood out way more than I thought it was going to. But yeah, one hundred percent. Oh man, I I feel so bad, man. It's just one hundred percent. I I'm glad that they won. They didn't get knocked out, but at the same time, oh man, that was such a conflicted like feel of winning. I, I, I wanted them to win, but at the same time, I didn't want them to win. And then they also picked Baro at the end. Uh, I get it, but 100%, that man Baro is going to have to change. Which I don't know how they're going to change him anytime soon in order for them to win the next match. I'm hoping he just has a moment where he, like, he finally realizes like this is just not going to work unless I start trusting my teammates a little bit. Yeah, I mean... Damn. Yeah, one hundred percent. Episode sixteen will be up pretty soon. But yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Peace.